Hello guys, Peter Mbiria here. For the M102 lovers, you have requested about a kit. So here it is. So right now I'm just testing with now my guinea pig engine here. Before it goes out to any client, it has to run this engine. And of course I'm taking all the parameters and all. Now, you can see the colon plugs right there. You can see the harness is neatly done. You can see uh, the fuel injectors. They're brand new actually. And then you have this brand new fuel rail. It has four injectors. Previously it had five injectors as I was utilizing the cold start injector. This was the previous setup. So two half fuel rails and then of course joint here because this was in the way. Couldn't have one street rail. But now I've done away with this. Now I'm having four injectors. Now, uh, this setup I'm just testing it right now. You can see my computer right here. You can see my fuel pump right here. Of course, you won't have this set up on your car. The fuel pump will be next to where the fuel tank is. And then what you're seeing there are just wires to control, well, to mimic um, the ignition key and all. Okay. So um, let's start it. I'm just collecting data. So how I start is first of all, pressurize the fuel by activating this pump you can hear it running and then I come here I turn on the ECU it's on and then I crank it this is just a button to crank and it's alive so I need to short this to wires so that it starts charging Okay, and then I need to activate uh, a switch for the fan. So wait here it comes just here. Yes, so right now uh, it's doing, let's see, um, oh it's not as clear, but it's doing 900 RPM idle. 900 rpm and then right now we are at uh, economy mode i can change the drive mode using this uh, dial here so if i change changes to comfort if i proceed further spot but now i'm just testing economy you can see the afr's values right there so it's between 15 and 16. during idle you don't want it to be rich whatsoever and so how does it accelerate oh that's nice that's really nice so after i'm through testing with all this i do preliminarily uh, a tuna so that now it becomes a lot easier for the client to do uh, installation. They don't need to have a very skilled person to do it. They'll receive a manual on how to install it. They'll also receive uh, two firmwares, one for setting up all these uh, harness sensors and all. And then the next firmware is to actually run the engine. So it's, it reduces the risk of uh, failure and it becomes a lot easy for the enthusiasts out there to do it themselves so this is a DIY, DIY kit for those who want to convert the uh, M102s and of course other engines doesn't have to be Mercedes-Benz could be Tujo, could be Nissan, could be Range Rover the kit will come like this one of course for the various engines it will be slightly different but this is it do uh, sport comfort that is it's quite something so if I turn off the ECU oh 
Now there are switches down here. Turn it off. Boom. Done. So yes, um, please follow my channel for more content like this. And there's another machine right here. Still working on it. The engine is somewhere else because it was being done some neat paintwork. But you see the results at a later date. Thank you.